log in now it's time to see the background step in the last session if you remember i had shown you the gherkin that uh, we had created and the gherkin that we had created looked something like this like this and there was uh, probably there was a colon here which i have removed there should be no colon for given when and then there should be only colons for background scenario and feature so this is the basic uh, simple uh, feature file that we had created and we ran this feature file and since there were no steps uh, there were there were no step definition files uh, we got a error and we got some uh, steps that were created by cucumber for us so what this time i have done is i copied those steps and pasted it in a steps.java which i have created under the uh, source folder in org.cucumber.test package so this is the file that contains the um, steps that were copied from uh, the output that came as a result of running this feature file so now here uh, what i have done is i will just walk you through the entire steps.java this is our step definition file for every cucumber framework to run we need a step definition file and we can have a runner class as well which i will explain in the next session uh, so this is a very simple uh, java file which has certain annotations and certain parameters regular expressions and uh, some selenium code so for now i have only put the proper selenium code for the given condition and for rest of the conditions rest of the annotations and uh, uh, methods i have put uh, system dot out dot print statements so let's have a look at this code so this is a public class steps in which i am uh, creating a driver object a web driver object called driver then i have a given step uh, i am uh, i just copied this from uh, the output and uh, the output error output that we got i am on new tour site and uh, this will be so uh, this is a function that gets created for us and inside this function i have put system dot set property web driver dot chrome dot driver and, and i have given the chrome driver jar file path here then i am instantiating the driver object to a new chrome driver and then i am getting the new tools dot demo dot com website then Further on, I have just uh, put a system dot out dot print element statements for the remaining things. So, I believe you can have a look here. This is uh, when I click on so and so link, so it will print click link. Then, when I enter first name, there is a system dot out dot print element for every thing that I am doing in the feature file. So anyway, I will put this entire code on GitHub. But for now, just remember that we need a step definition file for all our for running all our feature files. And uh, the main purpose of this video is to make you understand what a background step is. So uh, let's have a look at the official definition of a background step. Occasionally. you will find yourself repeating the same given steps in all of the scenarios in a feature file so uh, since it is repeated in every scenario it is an indication that those steps are not essential to describe the scenarios they are incidental details and you can uh, move the, all such given steps to the background by grouping them under a background section before the first scenario so what this background step does is it will run before each of the scenario in your feature file and uh, uh, what what things can you put in a background step things such as opening the browser or opening the browser and then logging in these kind of common uh, common uh, features or common steps that you need to follow before executing any scenario can be grouped together and put into a background step so now let's have a look at how our feature file works with the background step we already have a background step given i am on new tools site and 
what this feature file once executed what it should do is it should open a browser a browser session with utools uh, website open and then uh, it will print out the system dot out dot print ln statements for the remaining and and when clauses okay here we go okay now it is starting the browser session there you go the new tools dot demo dot com will be opened now and once it opens then it will do the rest of the it will print out the rest of the statements as you can see print out uh, the rest of the statements like uh, given i am on the new tour site and this for this one it has navigated to that site and then it has just printed out click link enter first name enter last name enter phone enter email enter address one enter address two enter city enter state enter postal code enter select country enter username enter password submit click verify confirmation so this is how our feature file works and this is how background step works thank you